OK, look, I'll take you back. Uh, rugby union to start with, uh, the, the, uh, the raw blue and black of uh, Ponsonby. I had a bit of a go through my, my teen years, uh, going, going to Calston Boys, so um, that's, everyone knows back home that that's a union-oriented school there, so there's no rugby league. So going from there into Ponsonby, it was pretty much like the plan. And um, oh, that didn't end up working out for me, having a baby early. Like, I kind of just hung up the boots. And then um, my cousin, he, Dave Falafitu, he, he called me up one day and said, oh, just come down for a run, come down for a social run. Um, I went down and I think only played maybe two or three games before I was in the Richmond top side. And then there, was, there were just some names on the side that happened to be watching that day. Warriors, I suppose, was the start of the rise for you, but the player of the year in the Vulcans over to the Bulldogs. But then a couple of injuries started niggling away. Dizzy was pretty keen on me coming across, and the aura that Diz Hasler has, like I, all I wanted to do was impress him. And so it was ugly getting that oh, six and a half month um, injury. It was it was a tough time. It was a tough time at the time. But opportunities are, are around, aren't they? You know, and then an opportunity comes uh, to, to sign up with the Tigers. And um, this year, in particular, you hit the ground running, but it, it took a little while as well. I did. I did another injury, Liz, Liz Frank, Liz Frank injury, dislocation of my foot, and that was. I was out for a similar amount of time, six months. And I'm injury free, and man, I'm ready to pounce, as the Tigers would say. Uh, you're not without a few uh, fellow Kiwis uh, at the Tigers. There's plenty in the top side, and there's even more in the State Cup. And I think almost maybe half or three quarters of the 20 side are Kiwis, and it's just a real homey feel there. Like. Um, not only like a family feel all throughout the club, but you know, there's, it's always good to have, hear some um, some Kiwi lag around, and you know, just to, to joke around with a lot of the boys where you can relate to. And we're we're not all from the same places back home, but we just have that um, that Kiwi feel. Speaking of family, um, Kenny, your younger brother, it's unfair, isn't it, that your younger brother is actually a bigger brother, and you're not a small man yourself. I mean, he's he's massive, isn't he? Six foot four. With his new haircut, I think he might be 6'7", six, 6'8". Six, he's got the big flat top. Yeah, he's got the big fresh prints going on, so... He plays in the 20s. He plays in the 20s, so he's been, um... Yeah, he's been going well uh, lately. Um, really excited for me. What sort of uh, goals out there for uh, for the Gave brothers? Eventually, I do want to play against... Oh, against... <laughs> alongside uh, Kenny, but yeah, it'd also be good to play against him too. So. Yeah, oh yeah, older brother, got to sort the younger brother out. Yeah, it's, it's kind of hard when you're looking up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, you look very happy, uh, James, and we wish you uh, all the happiness in the future as well, and that will be uh, determined by uh, injury-free season with a little bit of luck. That's it, man. Thanks, Thanks, Thanks for coming Cheers. up, bro.